In this video, I'm going to create this part. It's a lower die one center. It's part of the button maker uh, project. And this is assignment 8.1.p, uh, model button maker. And this drawing is on page 20 of the Word document. So I'm going to go ahead and go to Inventor. And I'm going to verify that I'm my project is the button maker project. And that there's a check there. I'm going to hit Done. Then I'm going to go and create a new part and it's a new sketch on the XY plane. Let's start out by drawing a line uh, from the origin and uh, the distance of that line is um, 2.125 divided by 2. Tab. 0, tab, enter, and hit escape. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and lock this line so it doesn't move. It's always a good idea to lock your first geometry that you create. And uh, so I'm going to create a second line from the origin going straight up. And that's uh, 1.531. going to lock this line too. I'm going to create another line from there going across and uh, that is uh, 1.5625 divided by 2 tab 0 tab enter and then this next line, I don't know the length of it, but I'm just going to draw it straight down. Click, escape. Um, one more line from the end here. Straight up. A distance of 0.156. Tab, 90. Tab, enter. And then I'm going to go straight across. to that line there and hit escape twice. I'm going to get my trim tool and trim the, the end line there. I'm going to hit the green check. I'm going to uh, revolve the part around uh, this axis and hit OK. I'm going to uh, create a sketch on this surface I'll put a point at the center, green check. I'm going to use the uh, hold tool and uh, let's see it calls out for a threaded hole and it's a quarter inch, quarter twenty, that's right. And, uh, let's see it's a countersunk hole. At the top of the countersink is 0.375 and it's 82 degrees. The thread length is 1 inch. So I'm going to change that, change that to 1. And so uh, the depth of the hole I'm going to increase from 1 to 1.25. And uh, hit OK. I'm going to add a chamfer along this uh, top edge and they're specifying a chamfer of uh, 0.03 I'm going to specify a, a radius or fillet of 0 0.031 around this edge here. Check. Now, the only other thing I want to do is I want to create an axis and uh, on all parts uh, that are going to go into an assembly uh, you should put down an axis. So I'm going to put an axis down the center of the part 
and uh, make sure you extend the axis so that it's visible and when you're assembling it you could uh, assemble things uh, based on the axis so I'm going to go ahead and change the material of the part uh, it's made out of steel I'm going to go to high properties uh, physical change from generic to uh, steel hit OK last thing you want to do is save the part, uh, do save as, and uh, use the title 7 lower die 1 center. Uh, go ahead and save it. I've already saved it, so I'm not going to do that here. 